everyone i am currently filming in my wardrobe which i have like a walk-in wardrobe it's a room but at the moment i'm making it over redoing it just painted it it's still a bit haphazard half my clothes are in here half them everywhere else upstairs everywhere so yes i'm filming in here because this is where i'm thinking i'm gonna eventually gonna start to film more regularly regularly literally um so yeah apologies that it's a bit of a tip behind me but this is real life and these are some of my clothes don't know if you can tell i like stripes yeah anyway so today what i've got is a bag reveal for you i bought something from coach in this bag here first thing i've ever bought from coach and i really like the brand in general i think it's a really nice um, classic most of the pieces are really like classic designs obviously they have some like fun wacky wild designs as well but I just love the brand I think it's a really really nice brand I've always wanted I'm gonna move this for a second I've always wanted a designer bag I've wanted a, I love Balenciagas I love Pradas I like Burberry but obviously those bags are cost like in excess of a thousand pounds and that's not something I'm willing to pay at the moment I need a new car first. My car broke down today, actually. So I need a new car before I start buying thousand pounds on handbags. Plus my parents might actually kill me. So I thought Coach is still a designer brand and it's something that I really enjoy, but it's not quite in the range of the Pradas that I like and things and the Louis Vuittons. So um, I went to the Coach store and there was quite a few bags that I liked. I saw a tan one, a black one, different style kind of tote bags and I couldn't really decide which one I wanted. But I had a few and I tried them on, kept looking in the mirror, and then eventually I picked this one. So it came in a pretty little coach bag and a dust bag as well. And I'm gonna take it out and show you, reveal it to you. So I'm starting a new job soon, and I thought, what more of an excuse to celebrate a new job than to get a nice new design handbag? So that was my justification for it. So it came in a beautiful little coach dust bag and you know if it comes in a dust bag it normally should probably be stored in a dust bag but yes i'm gonna get inside and show you da, 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 da. this is my new coach bag and it's black and i don't really normally gravitate towards black it's not a color that i really really pick in especially in handbags anyway i saw a tan one like i said they do a tan in this one and a tan in a slightly wider boat shape like more of a bucket shape sorry and I really wanted that one at first but I thought no go for black it'll be smart and more practical and I just I always gravitate towards tan so I was like this time stick with the black so as you can see it's a really really nice leather black bag from coach it's kind of like um like an embossed leather I think that's what they call it like kind of like a grainy leather almost and there was like I say more of a bucket shaped one which originally I did like and it had thinner straps like more slinky straps that didn't look as good quality to be honest but this one is more slightly tapered in, more narrow, more structured, definitely. And yeah, I just, I love it. I thought it's really classic and would be great for work and look very professional and smart. So it does fit on my shoulder. I do like my bags to go on my shoulder. I like them to have to fit on my shoulder. And yes, it's got the coach emblem here. It's got the straps that obviously duck down. And that was the thing with the other one as well. The straps were like stayed. And I like the fact that they can hang down and then on the back it has this like a nice zip and all the like the quality of it's lovely like all the um fastenings and the zips are all good quality so there's like a back pocket there and then it's got like the studs underneath these straps as well and then inside it has a main zip sorry first and um, that's really important for me because I like to zip my handbags up and have like some extra security. I'm not too keen on ones with just like poppers or where they don't close properly. So this one has got like a nice big um, inside. I, it, I have already used it so there might be some little specks of dust in there. But it has a like, I don't know if I can show you, a side compartment and your phone compartment. And then an inside zipper as well with like an inside compartment in there. So it's not too big, but it's big enough to fit all the necessities that I need in for work. And like I say, it's really structured and classic. And yeah, I just really, really love it. So I thought I'd share it with you guys today. I have tried to find the name of it, but I can't. So um, what, I, what I most managed to get from the description that all I could find online 
was coach medium let me go and get this now coach medium tote bag yeah i think that was all about all i got coach medium size tote bag and there was another name was another name and it was, was it was signature coach bag but either way it's one of their like classic styles they do it i think every season perhaps with a little twist of detail change and like i said they do multiple colors as well I definitely would like to purchase more from more things from there. I don't think it'll be my last purchase from Coach. I really do enjoy it and I love the quality. I pop it down now. <laughs> it's a great happy medium between like a designer bag, but not breaking the bank too much. So yes, I thought I'd share this with you guys because I love to shop, I love bags, and hopefully if you're watching this, you do too. So make sure you hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. I probably will do an updated what's in my bag with this bag in the future if you want to see that please comment down below and let me know make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're not already so you don't miss out on my future videos and thank you so much for watching today guys bye